Hi, in today's video we're going to take a very basic look at what constitutes a glaze. A ceramic glaze is essentially just a glass coating surrounding the clay body and it generally consists of three components in the majority of cases. A glass former, a flux and a stabiliser. The glass former is generally silica based and you can find silicon in all sorts of things. Uh, you find it in beach sand, you can get it in clay. Uh, probably the purest form would be quartz. Uh, the difficulty we have with silica is the melting temperature, which is around about 1700 degrees centigrade. Now that's way higher than the majority of kilns will reach. And in order to actually melt it, we have to add a flux. Now the flux is generally an oxide, and they're around about 10 normally used in glazes. And it's introduced from materials in the glaze recipe. And what they do is reduce the melting temperature of the silica fairly dramatically. Uh, they also alter the glaze in a few other ways. They affect shrinkage, colour and quite a few other properties as well. Now the third component of the glaze is uh, the stabiliser. Now generally this is alumina or aluminium oxide and without the stabiliser the glaze actually melts and just runs straight off the clay body onto the kiln shelf. So what the stabiliser does it suspends the glaze components in the mix and it alters the flow characteristics and also the uh, final hardness of the glaze. The proportions of silica, the flux oxides and alumina contained in the glaze are adjusted by the materials that we actually use to make the glaze. And each material that's used uh, may contain one, two or even three of the necessary components. But it's not necessarily in the correct proportions. And that's the art of the glaze creator to use the correct amount of each material and produce the glaze we're looking for. That just about covers it for absolute basic glaze chemistry. The uh, colours in the glazes are generally provided by metallic oxides such as iron, copper, cobalt and you may have also heard the term fritz used. Now these are uh, manufactured glazes and they're actually crushed and sold as a base glaze and they're useful because you, you're able to buy them with a known quantity of the essential glaze ingredients so they can be really useful as a starting point. Anyway, thanks for uh, watching the video. If you liked it, please do press the like button and maybe subscribe to the channel.